Philadelphia, the first town in the United States founded by an African American. This short trail will take you through the heart of New Philadelphia. The original town plot of 1836 consisted of 20 blocks with 144 lots. The town grew slowly, with only three families living here in 1845. The population peaked between 1855 and 1865, when about 15 families lived here at any given time. Life was always changing at New Philadelphia. The town was a haven for escaping slaves, for newly freed people, for the widows and orphans of the Civil War. New people moved in from New England, Ohio, and Kentucky. Others moved out to seek better lives in the West, that it made no difference to the surrounding community, that it was on McWhorter property, and that the route avoided low-lying, flood-prone areas. Squire in 1843. Louisa and Squire built this house about 1847 and lived here with their four children until Squire's death in Settlement of New Philadelphia accelerated in the late 1840s. One prom before turning on to Ann Street, take a moment to survey the rolling landscape. Most of the blocks before you were never developed. Possibly they were too low and swampy. To the southeast, across the fields and nestled in the woods, is the McWhorter Family Cemetery. Here lie Free Frank and Free Lucy McWhorter and all of their children, Judah, Sarah, Young Frank,